The Secret Lives of Animals, Unusual Behaviors and Adaptations. Have you ever been in awe of the animal kingdom's enormous diversity and pondered why particular species have evolved particular traits and behaviors? Animals have adapted to their environments in unique ways to survive and thrive, from colorful birds to camouflaged insects. Welcome to the Amazed channel. If you are deeply curious subscribe and let's dive in. Each adaptation serves a particular function in assisting animals to overcome the obstacles in their habitats, whether it is sleeping through the winter, ballooning up to fight against predators, or developing novel eating techniques. Let's look at some wonderful examples of animal adaptations and the amazing ways they have changed throughout time. Elephants cool off by using their enormous ears. Elephants are amazing animals who have developed numerous unusual adaptations to enable them to survive in their settings. The most amazing adaptation is their internal cooling system, which is made possible by their huge ears. Elephants may reduce their body temperature by fluttering their ears, which generates a breeze that encourages blood flow through the ears' arteries and helps to control body temperature. It is quite amazing to watch as they flap their ears, which serves a purpose as well. Elephants' enormous ears, which seem to flap slowly in motion and create a breeze around them, make for a captivating image when they flap them. This helps keep insects away from their faces and bodies while also cooling them off. Elephants use water in addition to flapping their ears to increase the cooling effect. They will occasionally splash around in a body of water and spray streams and droplets of water behind their ears with their trunks. This helps to cool their entire body by lowering the temperature of the blood vessels in their ears. Pufferfish have the ability to expand to more than twice their original size. They can fill their stomachs with water to expand if they feel threatened, which is one of their most remarkable adaptations. This protective strategy makes the pufferfish appear larger and more challenging to swallow, which can help to fend off possible predators. The pufferfish's sharp skin spikes, which are visible when it is inflated, can deter predators even more. It's interesting to note that pufferfish similarly swell up to flex their muscles. In captivity, where pufferfish are frequently housed in tanks that are too small for them, this behavior is frequently seen. The pufferfish can stretch their muscles and keep themselves healthy by puffing up. Pufferfish have another adaptation that sets them apart from other species, while they are most recognized for their capacity to puff up. Tetrodotoxin, a neurotoxic produced by pufferfish, can be fatal to people and other animals. The pufferfish uses this toxin, which is present in its skin, liver, and other organs, as a means of defense against predators. In fact, pufferfish are among the most dangerous creatures on the planet. Not properly preparing a pufferfish before eating it can cause severe illness and even death. Pufferfish is a delicacy in some cultures, such as Japan, and is prepared by chefs who have received specialized training in how to remove the fish's dangerous parts. The feet of okapi feature smell glands. Native to the Democratic Republic of the Congo, the okapi is a rare and fascinating mammal. The okapi, which has a remarkable look that combines giraffe and zebra characteristics, has developed a number of unusual adaptations that help it survive in its harsh environment. The okapi's scent glands on their foot are one of their most intriguing adaptations. These glands provide a fragrance that the animal uses to communicate with other individuals of its species and mark its territory. The okapi can establish and maintain their territory by leaving their scent behind, which is essential in a setting where resources can be sparse. The okapi's capacity to interact with their calves via infrasonic cries is another crucial adaptation. These cries are at a frequency that is inaudible to humans, yet the sensitive ears of the okapi can hear them. By doing this, the animals can talk to their offspring without letting any nearby predators know they're there. This is crucial in an environment where predators like leopards are widespread. The okapi is also renowned for having a tongue that may grow to a length of 14 to 18 inches. They can wash their eyes and ears thanks to this adaptation, keeping them clean and clear of contaminants. They also remove leaves from trees using their tongues, which is how they get most of their food. Tube worms consume poisonous water. A remarkable and unexpected ecosystem thrives in the deep, dark depths of the ocean, captivating scientists for decades. Hydrothermal vents, which shoot out superheated water and minerals from the Earth's crust, are at the center of this ecosystem. For many years, experts thought that such extreme conditions could not support life. But in 1977, scientists made a truly amazing discovery, enormous tube worms living 8,000 feet below the ocean's surface along the Galapagos Rift. 
The water in these hydrothermal vents is filled with acid and toxic gas, and the tube worms that inhabit them live there in complete darkness. These species have evolved in distinctive ways that enable them to live and flourish in spite of these seemingly hostile conditions. The absence of a digestive system, eyes, or a mouth is one of the tube worms' most notable adaptations. They are actually just bags of bacteria with reproductive organs and heart-like features. The worm's internal bacteria use the water's lethal hydrogen sulfide, which would kill most other species, as an energy source to create carbohydrates. Due to their extraordinary symbiotic relationship, tube worms are able to survive in environments that would be fatal to most other organisms. In addition to tube worms, the area around hydrothermal vents has also been shown to be home to crabs, shrimp, and clams. Because of their environment's extreme conditions, some animals have evolved in unusual ways. For instance, certain species of crabs have evolved unique hairs on their bodies that enable them to recognize and escape the flow of hazardous water. Cuttlefish conceal themselves in their environment. The capacity to instantly change their color and texture makes cuttlefish incredibly fascinating organisms with one of the most amazing traits seen in the animal realm. They have an amazing ability to blend in with their surroundings, rendering them nearly invisible to both predators and prey because of this. A complicated interplay between the cuttlefish's nervous system and its skin allows it to change color. Yellow, red, and brown pigments can be found in each of the cuttlefish's three layers of skin. The cuttlefish has a remarkable ability to produce a wide variety of colors and patterns by selectively activating various pigment cells. The cuttlefish may disguise itself in a variety of ways, color being just one of them. Additionally, they have a layer of skin that is speckled with microscopic bumps known as papillae. These papillae have the ability to expand or contract to produce a texture that blends in with the surroundings. For instance, a cuttlefish swimming close to a rocky seafloor may use its papillae to mimic the texture of the rocks on its skin. The cuttlefish's capacity to change both color and texture makes it a very potent predator. It may blend in with its surroundings to approach unsuspecting prey covertly or quickly alter its appearance to flee a pursuing predator. Cuttlefish can notice small changes in light and color thanks to their keen eyesight, which they use in conjunction with their ability to blend in. They are among the most visually skilled marine animals thanks to this and their capacity to replicate their surroundings. To survive the dry season, African bullfrogs construct homes out of mucus. It is extremely amazing how the African bullfrog can survive in such a harsh environment. The frog skin mucus, which allows it to breathe when it's outside of water, is essential to its life. Dehydration, however, is a continual danger in the warm African climate. In order to prevent this, the bullfrog buries itself underground and secretes mucus to form a protective cocoon. The frog is given a secure and wet environment by the cocoon that forms when this mucus membrane solidifies. Bullfrogs can stay in their cocoons for up to seven years while they wait for rain to fall. The bullfrog emerges from its cocoon when the rains finally do because the wetness softens the mucus sac, allowing it to reproduce and take advantage of the increased activity and food availability during the rainy season. The African bullfrog is a wonderful example of nature's flexibility and persistence because of its extraordinary capacity to live and prosper in a tough environment. Animals can struggle in the natural world because of resource rivalry and harsh environments. Animals have had to adapt in surprising ways in order to live. Learned something new? We hope so, and if you think this was brain blasting, keep watching more on our channel. Hope you enjoyed the video, follow for more.